Uh, so my name's Robert Bonner, uh, lockmaster of Lock 5 and 6. Been living on the lock since I was about five years old, and I've been the lockmaster at Lock 5 for about uh, eight years. Dad was a lockman at Lock 9, uh, and then we moved to Lock 5, and he was the lockmaster here at Lock 5. Uh, lock 5 was built in uh, and completed in 1927. Originally they were um, installed into the system for navigation for the paddle boats for um, trade up and down the river um, and now they're more utilised for uh, uh, irrigation and water supply for townships. Depending on the size of the vessel, dinghies or houseboats, we generally only mainly uh, do houseboats, so that's six high houseboats at any one time. Um, dinghies we've had 20 to 30 in there at any one time. They will either ring us by phone or they will give three long blasts of the horn and then um, we'll give them a red light when they can see we're actually notified their signal and then they'll get a green light to proceed into the lock chamber. Generally the upstream vessel gets right of way because it's harder to maintain uh, their direction with the flow pushing them down the river so you'll generally do uh, the upstream boat first before you do the downstream boat. The lock chamber itself is uh, hydraulically driven with hydraulic rams and then we've got a remote system that uh, lets us just do it from the centre of the lock chamber wall. The chamber's not actually pumped full of water, it's actually just uh, gravity fed. So we've got valves on the upstream side um, with a tunnel that runs through into the chamber on the upstream side with five ports and then they'll let water in and it's just done by gravity. About five and a half minutes to fill and five and a half minutes to empty. We've had anything from canoes, a swimmer come through, doing a record from the Hume down to the mouth. Frank Turton with his uh, strange, unusual vessel with his windmill and his dunny at the back. And <laughs> we've had a Massey Ferguson go down the river on a set of pontoons and go through the lock chamber downstream. It's about 17,759 megs a day going over lock five today. Uh, we regulate the flow um, under instruction uh, and we uh, use concrete stop logs um, and we put them into the weir or pull them out of the weir depending on whether there's more or less water um, travelling down the river. It used to be 365 days a year, now it's uh, all but Christmas Day. We start at 8 o'clock in the morning, 11.30 last lockage so we can knock off at uh, 12 o'clock for lunch, come back at 1 o'clock, uh, once again 4.30 last lockage so we can knock off by 5 o'clock and that's pretty much the day in the life of a lockmaster.